So we're going to be adjusting the can height photo eye um, so that when the cans go up, it triggers that photo eye and stops them at the correct height and orients them to the dead plate. Um, first, ensure that the, the photo eye is shooting across and hitting the reflector, which I can see from here that it is. If it wasn't, that orange light would go off and the green light would stay on. That's power two, and that's if it is seeing itself. Um, to start with, I will put the carriage at one can height away from where it's going to be, so roughly where the top of the cans are level with the dead plate and I'll make a mark at this tear sheet to let me know where that is from the vantage point down below. Bottom of the tape is no. Down, 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 down. Go on. There you go. That's it. Your vantage point is from the bottom of the tape to the tear sheet? Uh-huh. Okay. And we'll uh, raise this and see where it hits and adjust accordingly. Now we're going to go to the manual screen and hold down the up button. If you push that button once, it'll only go a little bit, but if you hold it down, it'll stop when the photo eye senses it. Okay. Now. Where the photo eye is now is a little bit high. You want it so that the tear sheet is about a quarter inch lower than the face of this dead plate. If it's too high like it is now, when it goes to push cans, it'll push the tear sheet out onto the conveyor. So we need to go down. Make sure it's pointed at the reflector. And try it again. That is just about right. It's a little bit lower than the dead plate, so that when it pushes cans, it will get, the tear sheet will get stuck in this notch on the top of the bevel and keep the tear sheet from going any further and push the rest of the cans. Now, if you're having problems with your photo eye, you can retrain your photo eye. Sometimes this is necessary if it's not quite aimed right or you have bright cans, which are super reflective. To train the photo eye, there's a button on this side, a small button on the photo eye, you simply hold it down for three seconds, the light will go out and then back on, and now it's retrained and works good.